Hey everyone, I'm meteorologist Hannah Dennis and we have another sunny day ahead. However, storms are returning next week, but we could see another good weekend. Now we are going to see some storms Monday afternoon into the evening hour, and this is what we're looking at. You can see this line starts to come through around 10 PM. That's when they really start to form together and they'll slowly move their way to the metro. But you can see as they get closer to the center of the state, things die down a little bit, and that's a good thing because that means these storms will start to fall apart as they start reaching the um, halfway through the state. But then everything kind of clears out as we go into Tuesday and we'll have those lingering showers in the morning. But for the most part, Tuesday is going to be fairly dry. Now, as far as how much rain we're going to be seeing, a lot of us could actually see one to two inches across the state, but it's not going to be a complete uh, washout. We're still going to see some areas that really don't get to see a lot because those storms do start to fall apart as they move through the state. However, when those storms start moving through, that's when things start to get a little windy. You can see Monday uh, in the afternoon and evening hours, that's when it starts getting windy. But after that, the wind calms down and we have calmer winds before that as well. So that is really the, going to be the only windy day that we have going into this week. Now, because we are seeing those storms, there is some severe weather possible, but you can see it's really staying towards the southwest. They're in that level two risk. Some of us are in that level one risk, so we could possibly see some severe storms, but it looks unlikely with those storms looking like they want to fall apart as they get closer to the metro area. Now, Monday's not going to be our only chance of rain. Tuesday, we'll have those lingering showers in the early morning hours, but for the most part, we will be staying dry on Tuesday. Now, Wednesday through Friday, we have smaller rain chances, and it's not going to be a complete washout on those days. It's going to be kind of like on and off rain, on and off thunderstorms, and so it'll be just here and there. But for tonight, we'll get down to 42 degrees. It's going to be a nice night. Those clouds will start to clear out a little bit, so we will get to see the night sky. And then tomorrow is going to be a perfect day. We're going to get up into the 70s. We're going to see a lot of sun, and it's just going to feel nice again before we see those storms roll through on Monday. And then taking a look at your 10 day forecast, you can see that we do keep the 70s for a little bit. Wednesday, um, Wednesday, Thursday and Friday, we have those rain chances along um, going into those uh, into the weekend. But you can see as we get into those uh, weekend days, Saturday and Sunday look like they're going to give us a lot of sun again. We're going to climb back up into those 70s and then we'll start off our of start off that following week fairly dry. So Mother's Day weekend looks like it is going to be a nice one.